Dr. Miller here. Let's take a look at the two equations behind me and see how they're solved differently. Both of the equations involve the division of a fraction. The first one, we have w over 3 plus 2 equals 6. And for this particular problem, we want to subtract 2 from both sides first. And then we get w over 3 is equal to 6 minus 2, which is 4. Then the second step is we're going to multiply both sides by 3. And then we get w equals 12, and that'll be our answer to the equation. Now, in the second one, we have y minus 1, that entire quantity, divided by 2 equals 5. And in this case, we're going to multiply both sides by 2 first. And then the 2s will divide out, and you get y minus 1 equals 10. And then, of course, we're going to add 1 to both sides, and you get that y is equal to 11. Note the difference here between the two. Here, when you have a fraction plus a number, take care of this number first by subtracting it from both sides. And here, when it's the entire side divided by a number, you multiply both sides first. That makes a big difference. You're essentially undoing the order of operations. Have a wonderful day. Let me know in the comments section if you have any questions on that.